Hello, I'm Adam and I'm the Artistic Director of Fairground Reminiscence. And this week we are collaborating with the Activity Bus to help you bring the spirit of the fairground at home. So today we thought it might be nice to share a little bit of uh, a dance and teach you that with some tin cans that's actually in the fairground show that we do, the Fairground Reminiscence performance. And um, so we're going to start by getting our bodies warm, nice and juicy and ready, nice and safe to uh, learn that dance. So we're going to start with a little bit of a warm up. So let's start by Ladies rubbing our hands together. Many songs have been written. Really fast. It's like we've got to build a fire within our hands. We're going to build the heat up really fast. We're going to get the arms involved, the biceps, the triceps, all the muscles of the arms, the forearms. Rub them really fast. Let's stand on our feet. Ah. Let's push the speed of the feet and rub them faster. We really feel that heat building between our hands. Ah, lovely. And let's place the heat that we just built on our face, on our forehead. Oh. And let that fly down the face like a treacle waterfall. Oh. Good, lovely. And let's just bounce, bounce the knees, shake the arms. Lovely. Okay, let's start with the shoulders. So we're going to isolate the wall with the shoulders to begin with. So we're going to send them forward. Arm back. Arm behind us. Arm to the centre. Again, let's send them forward. Arm behind us. And let's make some big circles. Bowing up with the shoulders. Big, juicy circles. How big can you make this journey of your shoulders going round? Let's reverse that. So let's send it. Shoulders behind us, and then in forward, and then behind us again, and then in front of us. And let's circle them round again, big circle, backwards, up and forward, slowly. And then let's get the elbows involved, let's circle the elbows. Good, you can bend the knees as you do this, get the legs involved, and let's reverse that. I'm going to do the same thing, just circling the arms and the shoulders, but with our arms stretched this time, so let's stretch the arms, and we stretch our fingers, really feel the edges of our periphery, and our fingers, good, and just reverse that over, a bit like that uh, swimming stroke butterfly it's called, isn't it, going up and over, good, and just shake them down, lovely, like you're trying to stretch Take some sticky candy floss off your hands that's melted, or some toffee or syrup, and to the side. Oh, good bounce legs, lovely, and shake out. Oh, lovely. Let's just warm up our spine a bit more. So we're going to start from the top of our head and snake it through, and then down and roll down to the ceiling. It's like a snake. Lovely, undulating movement. Good. Once more, and let's reverse that so our tail leads us backwards and we curve down. Good. It's like a, an undulating sea, a wave in the water. Good. And let's take that to the side. Head goes first. Good. Wow, we're really warming up the whole spine here. Good. Lovely, and let's make a butterfly with our hands. So, our thumbs cross over, and our fingers are the wings. Lovely, and let's paint that on our chest. Okay, we're going to paint our chest on a figure of eight. Just for you to warm up the top of our spine. Lovely, you can allow the focus to follow that. See the whole room, you might look a little bit dizzy. That's okay. Good. Lovely. Let's just work into the legs a bit more. So let's just do a very simple stepping sequence. So let's step forward to front feet and back. Good. Let's step back and forward. Let's go forward again. Centre, back, centre. Let's do the leg like back this time forward. Centre, back, centre. Lovely. Forward, centre, back. Centre. Let's step forward with one leg, forward, and let's step to the side on that same leg side, and let's step to the back. One, 
the center. Again, let's step forward. To the side. In. Back. In, good. Let's do the left side. So let's step forward. Forward. Side. Back. In. And then forward. Side. Back. In. Let's do that twice each side again, but jumping a bit more. So let's shift. Good. You can let the body relax on top. Good. Back. In. And forward. To the side. To the back. In and forward. Side. Back. In. Let's just step the legs out really wide. Wow. And step them in, step them in. And step them out. Wow. And step them in. Lovely. Let's just spiral around and swing our spines a bit. So let's just swing the arm round to the back. And to the side. Using our legs. Good. Stretch the fingers. Lovely. And let's just circle the arms, get the wrists involved, make sure we've warmed those up. So the thumbs out. Lovely. To finish, let's just take a balance on one leg. So let's just so stand on one leg and the other leg up. But can we take the leg up, up in the air on a journey around the space? Different balances. What? Lovely. And let's change the side. Good. And change the time that's here from. Squeeze our knee into our chest. And if you found that first balance really easy, let's take it another step and find this yoga tree position. So placing the sole of our foot on our thighs and our palms together. And our supporting foot. That's in contact with the floor, it's like a tree. And it's used to spreading into the floor, grounding us, making this position nice and strong. Lovely, let's change to the other side. And up, we're balancing, breathing our knee in, and opening the knot out. Taking the sole of the foot on our side, and palms together, good. Lovely. Hopefully you're feeling nice and warm and ready to learn our fairground tin can dance. I know I'm feeling really warm now. So what you need is your two tin cans and the idea of this tin can dance, it came from Tin Can Alley. It was a game that was in our fairground reminiscence installation. And the idea was to kind of make this game and other games in the installation become other things and almost another game in itself. So it's almost like a game of charades where these objects become something else. So it might become these tin cans, grab your tin cans. They might become a stelescope that you look and see the stars. Or they might become a pair of glasses, a pair of binoculars that you're looking through. Or they might become a hat, balancing this on your head. What else could they become? Some shoulder pads, can we balance them on our shoulders? A bit more tricky this, this time. Up. Or they might become a pair of stomp boots or high heel shoes that we can balance and step on. Can we balance on those? What? So the idea of this dance, we use the idea of that, that these tin cans become something else and become a game. And it's a bit silly, it's a bit fun and it's a nice dance to, to dance. So let's start with our two tin cans in front of us. And we start by reaching our arm around, one, and around again, two, to pick the tin cans up, and we look through our telescope at the stars, or it could be the kaleidoscope, those things that make different shapes as you look through them. We then bring the other tin can together, and it becomes a pair of binoculars that we're looking over the sea. They get sucked onto our eyes as a pair of glasses, one, and they come round by our ears and turn into a pair of headphones. Let's do that again. So tin can start in front of us, reach around one, two, we look through the telescope, we look through our binoculars. They get sucked onto our eyes, a pair of glasses, funky glasses, really bizarre glasses, and round to make our headphones. Now we can hear our favorite piece of music in these headphones and we go to the side four times like we're enjoying 
for listening to our piece of music and we nod our heads four times. One, two, three, four. From there, they come onto the floor. One, two, and we step on them like our high heels or platform boots and balance on our tin cans. One, and step down. Let's do that again from the beginning. So our tin cans are in front of us ready. We stretch forward, one, two, look through our telescope, our kaleidoscope, look through our binoculars, put our glasses on, our bizarre glasses, they become our headphones, whoop! And we hear our music, one, two, three, four, we nod, five, six, seven, eight. They come down, circle down, down, we step, up, we step up on them and balance, whoop! And we come down and look through our binoculars. From there, they come down to the floor, one and two, and we step up again here. From here, they get sucked to our chest like magnets, whoop, sucked to our bum, whoop, and that pushes it forward, and they come in front of us, and we have a little wiggle down, and we jump around the tin cans for four counts, one, two, three, four. So we go from the beginning, from there, so put our tin cans in front of us, so we're reaching round one, two, where we look through our kaleidoscope, look through our binoculars, put our glasses on, put our headphones on, listening to our music, our head banging dance, lovely. Down on the floor, big circles with the arms, step on our platform boots, look through our binoculars, they get sucked to our chest, whoop, sucked to our bum, whoop, we move that forward, do a little wiggle, four jumps around, we look through our binoculars again at the floor. So from there, we circle our arm around, one, and circle the other one around, we cross our, the cans on top of each other as we move to the side, and we cross them, moving to the other side. From there, it becomes a nice bottle of our favourite drink, so it could be a glass of fizzy orange or Ribena or a Coke or a milkshake. And we drink that all up as we turn around in a circle. From there we come apart and we go, because ah, it was a nice and refreshing drink. The can circle the arms down to the floor again. One, two, it then becomes a telephone. Hello. And then a microphone. Ah. And that's the end of our little sequence. So let's put that together with some music. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. Reaching one, two. We're looking through a kaleidoscope, binoculars, glasses, headphones. Four nods. Finding our stilts or platform boots, balancing. Up. So binoculars. Magnets, up, up. Look into our binoculars again, big circles, one. Stepping to the side, one. For one, drinking our drink. <sighs> Circling round. Telephone, hello. Microphone, hi. Brilliant. Hope you had a little taster and enjoyed being a bit silly and a bit fun today. And uh, if you feel like sharing some of your dances, you can upload them and tag them with hashtag fairgrammarminiscence or hashtag the activity bus. And we'd love to see what you come up with.